You might be wondering what makes pricing projects succeed or fail. I'm gonna go through a few key points from my experience on why our projects have failed and what makes them succeed. My name is Gabe Smith. I'm the Chief Evangelist for Price Effects. I have about 15 years in the pricing software industry and about eight years before that implementing large enterprise software projects. There are four key points that lead to pricing project success or failure. I'm gonna go through them. The first key point when it comes to pricing projects is data. It all relies on customer, product, and transaction data. And that data needs to be fairly clean and harmonized throughout your organization, or at least having a good plan on how to get there as part of the project. If that's not the case, you're really gonna struggle with enabling the types of analytics and optimization that will inform better pricing decisions as part of the project. The next key is executive sponsorship. You need an executive sponsor to be your champion in the organization, to get funding, to clear obstacles, and to drive alignment. If you don't have someone playing that role on your project, you're really gonna struggle to be successful. Another key to success is driving stakeholder buy-in. When you do a pricing project, you're gonna be touching a lot of roles in your organization, sales, marketing, finance, oftentimes product management, and other roles. If you're not clear on getting their buy-in and you're not devoting the time so they have a sense of ownership, then you're gonna really struggle. One of the most effective techniques I've seen for getting stakeholder buy-in is to involve those stakeholders upfront in the decision-making, also involve them in the requirements definition and devote some of your time to making their lives better. By doing that, it's gonna be a lot easier to get their buy-in when you come to roll out the project. If you don't get that buy-in, that adoption is going to be really difficult and adoption is really key in helping to drive the value of a pricing project. The last thing that can make pricing projects fail is having an unclear definition of success. When you are driving to somewhere, oftentimes you'll put in that destination in your GPS and it'll give you a way to get there. If you're just driving around aimlessly, you're probably not gonna get where you wanna go, right? So what we need to do when we think about a clear definition of success is define the KPIs that we're trying to move what kind of ROI that we're looking to drive and what kind of timelines, and really have a plan and clarity across the organization on how you're going to get there. That is what's going to lead to your success and really be able to measure that and then point back to it to say, hey, here's the kind of impact that we've driven in the organization and here's the value that we've delivered. I hope that was helpful to you. Now you know some of the key drivers for success or failure in enterprise software projects, particularly around pricing. If you found this video helpful, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Happy pricing.